Assalamu alaikum and hello everyone. My name is Akil Nofal Bema Mechanism from Scholar and Life Center 2 in Standard France from Berlin. Today I'd like to talk about Robot Sumo. A fun and exciting competition where robots try to push each other out of the ring. Just like sumo wrestling. The goal is for one robot to stay in the ring by forcing the other robot out. When designing a robot sumo, you need to focus on a few key things. The robots are small, with strong motors and good wheels to grade the surface. They are built low to the ground so they don't tip over easily. Many robots use sensors, like in Fred or ultrasonic to find the edge of the ring and detect the opponent. These sensors help the robot move smartly and avoid falling out of the ring. Now, let me tell you about my own experience in robot sumo. I recently participated in a competition at Kulim Kedah known as Nicers and then I took part in another one in Penang called PIRC Robot Competition It helped me improve my robot skills and much more Programming skills against other participants It was challenging and rewarding experience that taught me a lot about strategy and teamwork. There are many advantages to joining Robot Sumo competitions. First, it helps you <coughs> learn engineering and programming as you build and program the robots. Second, it's a great way to practice problem solving because you always need to think of new ways to improve your robot. And lastly, it teaches teamwork and sportsmanship. You get to compete, but you also learn from others and share ideas. In short, Robot Sumo is not just about winning, it's about learning new skills, being creative, and having fun. Okay. Lastly, I want to show you my robots. The robot that we got here is my first robot here. This is the front. This is the side. This is the back. And this is the top. I have another one here. This is the front top, side, and back. Lastly, I want to tell you guys, Robot Sumo is a great way to learn coding and much more. So, please consider trying new things and bye. Thank you.